Hi, this video shows how to solve the following error when you have an uh, ASP application, ASP.NET Core, let's say something like this. This is a default test, nothing is in there, simply ASP Core.NET 6 as a solution. Properties, uh, where is it here? Uh, properties here, .NET 6, somewhere it's written .NET 6, come on, here, .NET 6. When you try to install this one on a default ASP uh, uh, Internet Information Server, so that's this one, and you have there the version 10, for example, it's r running on Windows 10, and this software is also Windows 10, then you will not be able to open file a config file this is the one that i have here when you try to open this you get this error the data cannot be read okay and when you try to open it then you will get an error like this bum, 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 bum. come on here it is it says hbv 519 error and then there is the important stuff 807000d IIS web core and the solution therefore is you won't find it on a normal stuff uh, the solution is uh, in the new files in the previous files even in uh, ASP.NET Core uh, until .NET 5 and 6 you have this ASP.NET Core module in your config file so the IIS is working as a shell and it routes everything to the uh, to the Castrel server. And the new Castrel server needs the uh, setting, this one, ASP net core module v2. And you get this v2 here under .NET, Microsoft uh, download .NET 6. And that's the point, .NET 6 and .NET 6 is IIS runtime support for core module v2. Uh, I hope you find the solution on there, install this stuff, and if you like it, then make a thumb up on your uh, on the video.